Welcome. Now I know it might sound a treason, but I did find an indicator that is very useful for smart money concept trading or ICT concepts. Now I have to state down the fact that I did not use indicators in the past almost seven years. So this is the first time that I was surprised that a set of indicators would actually provide me some fairly good results if I was using them in confluence with the smart money concepts. So it could help me out filter some bad trades or actually help me to, you know, nurge a little bit to take on those better looking trades. All right. So this set of indicators is actually free. You can download it. I'm going to show you where you can download it, but there is a version and an entry method that you can download and review in my private discord but check out the video i think it's a great set of indicators okay so this indicator system or set of indicators is called xar the trend following system i was using this in the past few weeks as kind of a confluence uh when i was searching for entries using ict concepts concepts i was not using indicators since 2017 or i never even really wanted to go into indicators i was testing this set of indicators last year as well for a little bit for a while and i must say if i take out the unnecessary stuff from it we can how should i say refine the smart money entries i mean in a quite excellent way i may say so so we can find some real juicy entries with this set of indicators uh, it's, it's actually free so if you google it um you find a few pages not too many if you just type in xard trend following system you're gonna find only a few pages of it but the main page where this can be found is on the forex station forum and the creator of the system is called XARD. Um, at least that's what we know. That's his username. And as you can see, there's quite a few different versions. I don't even know, maybe 50 versions of this indicator, or even more, like 80 or 90. I don't even know exactly. Like, like um, if you go to Forex Station Forum, you're gonna find a lot of versions of this. A lot. I mean, I mean, most likely every user uh, is downloading their own particular set of how they want to go on with this indicator or how they want to use it. I'm going to show you how I put it on the charts and how I utilize it for futures uh, markets. As you can see, quite a few different versions. So if you go there, you can find some versions in the downloads. But uh, I just want to say that this is a free indicator. Uh, you can go for it. You can search for it. The method how I'm using and how I enter some trades uh, I'm just opening up a new section in my Discord, a new entry model, uh, how I'm using it in confluence with the ICT concepts. So you guys uh, are able to, to check that out if you join my Discord. I'm not selling this indicator. I just told you you can download it for free. But the way we utilize some entries and the exact set or the setups or the files what I use uh, with these sets are being found in my discord membership anyway let's jump in and uh, i'm going to show you what uh, i mean by that so i have an i have a meta trader opened up it's a demo account so uh, we don't have to go overboard too much with this one uh, so this is a demo account at ftmo uh, but you can actually open a demo account anywhere this is how the version i use look like it's Actually, it's uh, almost one of the latest versions, but I did take out some stuff that I didn't really need it. Hold on, let me take out this that I didn't really need it in this one. So uh, let me go back a little. And it's not that complicated, actually. It does have some portions that are repainting. Actually, um, as you can see, we do have moving average here. Uh, it utilizes moving average and if we go to the indicators the main indicator is also says that we have some moving averages uh, you can play with the settings uh, just the way you want to you know 
you can uh, play with the moving average shift cycles and numbers and everything uh, as I said I'm not gonna go into the details because we're gonna be spending an hour here but there is quite a few stuff that you can play around with um, also if um, also what you see here these dots are pretty much like a different version of the so-called fractals or fractals I'm not gonna dive into what are fractals you just google it what are fractals in trading uh, these are significant points of I would like to go with with swing points in price which is very good I mean so these points are repainting so these fractal points or dots are repainting so for example this one here it was definitely already painted in this area then it just got pushed down there that doesn't really matter it's it's not that important it just gives you kind of an kind of an insight of where it could be a stronger swing low uh, a weaker swing low uh, and so forth okay so we have a nice uh, clock here we do have a, um, a special indicator down here which which is kind of an RSI a version of an RSI I don't even want to say anything stupid because uh, I don't want to disrespect the uh, the guy who coded this. Uh, I seen I've seen many many version um, of the RSI. As you can see, the calculation method is basically just a regular RSI, not that difficult. So let's just go on that this is an RSI uh, combined with the moving average. But so let's let's not complicate that. Uh, the good thing is that smart money traders do like that we have some uh, we have the uh, market times separated very good we have the daily midnight open which is not accurate at this point but um, I'm not gonna go into that right now what you see here is this thick line there that is actually a zigzag indicator so this arrow right here is also nothing special it is just a simple and free indicator that has been reprogrammed or refined that's just a zigzag indicator with some arrows so all this you can find basically in your metatrader for free but this set of indicators are actually something that i do really like it helps you to give you a kind of a confirmation where to enter or where not to enter uh, a certain trade for example this right now is the US 2000 or we can call it Russell but I'm gonna go to the Nasdaq as well but since we're here already let's just uh, look for a really simple entry uh, here and uh, which is going to be the YouTube 2022 model so what we're looking for is actually a confirmation that we are going into a certain direction of a trend so the trend is your friend make sure you're going with the trend and I would say that if you go down and uh, just check if everything is aligning with your trade then you should be able to pull off some real good real nice and juicy ICT entries for example it's not gonna be the picture perfect entry but I just saw this actually I did not scripted this <laughs> video but I just saw this here um, there is a fair value gap oh my god I cannot pull it out here but uh, oh yeah because it's um, the indicator is going to the top so anyway you guys know what I mean so there's a fair value gap here uh, but it's coming to the front so I'm not gonna go to the details there's a fair value gap right there and as you can see down here the RSI moving average and the indicator just crossed to the upside um, the moving averages are showing and the, they are separated for in my understanding it's much better if these uh, averages are still separated so these are separated pointing to the upside we just came back from a little bit of a pullback you can see here there is a very nice uh, fair value gap here and boom you can enter at least with the one to one risk reward ratio but if you don't even want to take the end of the wick and you just put it right here and as you can see it perfectly takes out a one to one trade okay let me just go for another one um, for example this is not that picture perfect but uh, but you can also go along as price was swinging around this point this is also a good one uh, well let's see a better one this was also actually I would have taken this one and I was not trading the Russell this morning so 
I would have jumped in here. Small uh, movements here. Fair value gap, not that big a swing. Stop loss here, take profit up there, one to one. You can go for one to two. I have not tested it out in that deep. Uh, things I'm already fine with the one to one. But anyway, let me change to the um, NASDAQ here real quick. So we're here on the NASDAQ. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Let me find you another good example just to show you how great this is. Now, also, you can filter out what trades not to take. For example, there is a fair value gap here, as you can see. But the reason I would not take it, and this indicator helped me to avoid, uh, or at least not helped me, but um, kind of gave me a secondary option that maybe I should not jump into a long position, even though that price actually went down all the way from this top here and repriced this fair value gap. As you can see, the RSI, which I know that ICT absolutely, I mean, let's not go into that. I know he doesn't really like these kind of stuff, but the purpose of the two, this video is not that, to go into that deep. So uh, actually it told me it's not okay yet. I want to see the curve down here to be changing back up. The trades I want to take, if only if I use this indicator Again, I'm not using this indicator for my funded accounts and for my evaluations. I was just surprised because I took a uh, FTMO demo account on this one. Oops, I just clicked the wrong button. So I just took a demo account on this one and I was surprised how good of a trades it could provide or good entries or filter out some bad trades. Anyway, um, for example here, uh, not the best one, but still, we see this curve going up, changing direction. We have market structure shift here and here. You could have also taken this trade looking for a stop loss here over these swings and the one to one, there you go. You could have had this one, but I want to look for a better one. I think we had some better, better trades yesterday from the, uh, even from the New York session or for, was it at the London session? Maybe it was, maybe it was in the London session. Yeah, it was. So for example, yesterday, which was the 18th of January, London session, there you go. Beautiful, changing direction up here, market structure shift on the one minute. Sorry, I didn't told you this is the one minute. Uh, stop loss down here and take profit up there. Perfect for a one-to-one -one trade. And also saves you on this one, not to jump in right here because we are, you know, curving down from the upside down there. I want to look for something like this. For example, we're still in an uptrend and look at that. We're down here. The RSI is curving back up there, looking for a structure shift. Uh, technically we had a structure shift here on this candle. Uh, okay. This candle happened. Oh yeah. This time is the uh, brokerage time zone. So this should have been around, uh, this should have been around three, 350 AM Eastern standard time. So there was the fair value gap here. Uh, beautiful curve up there. Moving averages pointing nicely up. And there you go, another one-to-one -one trade. So it's beautiful. Um, we can find trades all around if you go with the trend. So this is why it's called trend following system. Another thing, if the moving averages are separated this much or even in a bigger distance, I would not jump into a trade. I want to wait. I would like to wait for the moving averages to, you know, collapse a little bit more and maybe look for better ones. But of course it can provide false entries as well. But I know we had news or there was a market open. Yeah, so this was news. Of course, we're not trading around the news. So uh, that's a base rule for me not to open trades just before or after because there's no indicator that gonna save you from that. So. Anyway, uh, th and there was market open right here. Also, if you're trading futures, you have to be careful, extra cautious here. So you have to put in your own personal filters and confluence into this. But um, so far, I'm quite satisfied with the results. I'm just checking if we had some other entries only based on this indicator uh, with some fair value gaps, but so far nothing. Um, maybe this one here, not the strongest one, but it's still a short opportunity here. 
from this swing low, this one minute candle here broke structure. This was in the PM session, broke structure here. And the next one too, we had the retracement finally into this small fair value gap there. You could have taken it by taking the stop over here and boom, there you go. So it was with the trend, it was curving back down to a bearish scenario. I really like that. So there are some more settings and some more confluences that are quite interesting and important uh, to follow with this system. Uh, I'm going to be uploading some more details because I do find it very, very good. And this is since seven years or eight years. This is the first indicator set of indicators, I should say, that uh, um, I think it can it can give you some clean signals. And it's very good for smart money concepts. And I did have some very good results on FTMO with it. Um, here are some metrics. It's not everything. I was only risking like around a hundred dollars on each trade. It was only a 50 K account. So, and I was trading for like, uh, I don't even know. It was during the holidays. So as you can see during the new year, December 29, 30 new year, I was taking very small trades, hundred dollar trades, but as you can see, I still made uh, almost $1,000 in a few days just by risking a very small amount. Of course, I had losing days with it as well, but there were some nice winning days too. And I was uh, mostly trading uh, the US 100, which is a CFD, but you can use it very nicely for futures. All right. So uh, there's going to be updates uh, about this. Uh, if you want the, the whole setups and the files which I am using, you can go to my Discord uh, and subscribe to our membership because um, I share everything there with my members. It's only 10 bucks. Otherwise, it's a free indicator. You go to the forum, you can download all the, I don't know, dozens of versions of it and you can put together your own. Uh, but this system so far is looking good. And, um, and anyway, uh, please let me know. Um, make a comment if you feel feel free to ask questions or or comment on this one drop a like and uh, there's gonna be more updates thank you so much for watching and uh, see you on the next one all right